Okay, I think this is where the movie's gonna be. Yeah, okay. So, just press this button, and let's watch the movie. What, what is that? <laughs> oh, that is so funny. Hello, everybody. This is Dr. Coconut here, and today I'm gonna show you this cool new thing I made. So, notice that a pig just got up and flew away on my screen right now, and this is not using any mods. This is 1.8. This is vanilla, and it's awesome too and over here we can see the work behind it yes it's command blocks I didn't I didn't I did use some cheats but still this is something that's almost completely unseen on YouTube uh, I think I saw one video on this but other than that I didn't see something of this extent and when we come over here notice that there's a tree coming up and going down this is my first animation. I wanted to play around with the slash clone command. This is what I use. And basically what a slash clone command is, is it clones, well, as it says in the name, clones this over to a spe specified area. So all of these sections are being cloned over here. And this can work for 3D also. You can clone a certain box or section, make a 3D animation, that would be cool. And it's all fun. So, you might have noticed this, and I'll show you what that is. And this is a bigger version, so after I did the pig one and the uh, tree one, I decided to do something bigger, and this took me twice as long. It's BB-8 from the Star Wars movie, the new one that came out when I recorded this video and I just decided to make a BB-8 going around and this took a lot of time of course but it was so much easier thanks to this command you didn't have to do slash set block for each of those blocks you just had to slash clone an entire section here and create a little frame animation like this guy so this is the part of the episode where I show you, show you how to do this so I will be back so over here I have a small example of an animation, it's a dude waving his hand. And this is all cool, and this is fun, and it's just a good example. So yeah, I'm going to do the exact same thing right next to it. What you need is a command block, some repeaters, and some redstone. And probably a lev lever or something. That You cannot make this in survival mode, sorry about that because it uses cheats and you can only do that in creative mode so also you need a certain command this is in the description all you have to do is control C control V copy and paste it into Minecraft and we can work on that from there so we put that one command block there and now keep in mind that the stuff that's gonna be cloned I'm gonna show with this polished andesite is all the way over here, 10 blocks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. It's actually 9 blocks, sorry. But if I added the 10th block, it would've, it would've teleported the, the, the command block too. So, now that we have this area, also keep in mind that it's 10 blocks tall. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So this is the area we're dealing with, a 9 by 10 square. And yeah. So with this clone command, uh just gonna show that it works. Boom. We created that little square thing over here. We created that line up, but we didn't do the thing we didn't do these blocks under it because it only clones this area inside of it and apparently it clones one block more so I guess it's 10 by 10 sorry about that so this is the area we're dealing with if I do it now it sort of moves oh okay but this is the area we'll de we're dealing with so we are gonna create a stick figure so here are the legs I'm not a very good artist I mean it takes me a lot of time to create something like BB-8 and anything past that I would have to look at a picture to do so there we go keep in mind that this face 
is going to point in the same direction over here. So we don't want him pointing the wrong way. So now we have a, a dude. And he's just standing up, chilling. And if we do that, there we go. We have a chilling guy over here. And let's just create him a ground. This ground isn't going to change. It's just going to stay there. There we go. We have a dude. Now to make him animated. So we get the same command over there. A cool trick is control and then middle click with the scroll key to copy and paste it automatically into the console command. And now that we have it there, the only thing we have to change is this number. It says 30 right now. It's 30 blocks 30 blocks away from this area. We have another we have our animation. So we're going to change this to 28 because we're going two blocks forward. It's 28 blocks away now. And we are going to do pretty much the same thing, except for a minor difference. So we're not going to create something completely different. Unfortunately, we have to still create the base and the head. But this time, we're going to change his arm. So now he's waving down on that arm, at least. And maybe let's make him do some ridiculous his arm over there is going to be up, so he's doing a weird, like, banana, like, Egyptian dance. And over here, we are going to copy that command, and we're going to change it to less, 26. And we are also going to create the same guy, and now his arms are straight because he, all, he just waved. And there you go, there's his head. Copy this command, just keep on repeating this. And 24, and bum bum. I can't do any more because the lava, I, I would have to spend some time changing that. And now we are going to make him do the opposite. And there we go, there's our animation. That wasn't too hard. And now all you have to do is put repeaters pointing into them. And redstone right here, 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 and here repeaters going this way you can time those repeaters as much as you want that'll tell you how fast it goes so in the piggy animation I made some of it faster some of it slower to just make it seem more realistic if a flying pig can be realistic so now we have um sort of a guy who looks like he's trying to fly actually <laughs> uh, it's not perfect sort of looks like he's dancing and this is where the timing comes in. We change it so this guy, boom, boom, and boom. Now he doesn't look as insane. He's just sort of like his arm is just going up and down. And there we go. We have a waving guy. And in here, you can put anything you want. And if you want the animation to be bigger, you go over here and you ch you make these two numbers bigger. These This is up and down and this is left and right. So yeah, that's how you create a movie in vanilla Minecraft. If you liked this video, uh, please like and subscribe, and comment if you want another animation, because I can make these, and it's actually pretty fun to do. So, like and subscribe, comment if you will, this is Dr. Coconut, and adios.